Hello. Um, well, last year I had my first official album out. Uh, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Now, when I say official, it means under a record label and got released on all major streaming platforms, which is like Spotify, iTunes, Deezer, which I need a publisher and a record label to do that. So, although I've done CDs before, well, I think I've done over 20 or 30 CDs, but they've just been off, off songs, off cover songs, me singing other people's songs, really. Um, I've not really done a proper album by songs that I've written before. Well, last year I did that, and uh, it got released under a record label. So in between, from last year, last March, April, something like that, it got released... I started recording like songs on CD to sell at my shows. Uh, and I did a reggae CD, which some of you might have seen me post the videos up of some reggae songs, um, like Stuck On You by Lionel Richie and Lady in Red in reggae version, just cover songs, um, just to put it up at my shows, which I will be taking orders um, on them because some people show the a bit of interest in them so I'll probably send a few of those out and get a few copies done on them for people but in the meantime I've been working with a band and had a new offer on a record label uh, Umbug Records which is very uh, popular among the rock and roll community among the rock and roll uh, festivals and uh, the weekenders and things like that and this company can offer a lot a lot for me uh, they've got the publishing rights to release on iTunes, Spotify, Deezer and that. They've got um, contacts with radio stations and things like that. So uh, it can offer a lot. And they've um, introduced me to a band which we'll, I'll be recording with. So all the, the new songs that I've been writing will be done with a, a rock and roll band. And uh, I've, been, I've got about uh, 14 songs rec uh, written. And we've... I've done some demos to send to the band to get them to record, but that won't be ready to about the end of the summer or something like that. But in the meantime, I probably will be putting out some CDs of covers and things like that and probably getting some more copies of last year's album. So I just thought I'd give a little explanation to people on Facebook uh, on what, what, I, what to expect this year and what I did last year because I do want to get mixed up with the the cover CDs, which is just stuff that CDs that I've printed from home, printed out, copied off, and then just like send them around to people. But they're just like you know cover songs. But the this, the album I did last year was a proper released album that was uh, printed and done by a factory. Uh, the CD was, and it was put out by a proper record label. And that they was all my own songs what I'd written. And this next one, this album, what I'm going to do this year, they are all. all songs written by myself and it will be a, a pure rock and roll album based on the 50s and 60s stuff that's that's influenced me over the years like Jerry Lee Lewis, Chuck Berry, Little Richard, Shaking Stevens, Elvis all those singers I grew up listening to and uh, I'd like to do a proper rock and roll album which at the moment is sounding really good and I'm really pleased with it uh, there's a lot yet to be done the cover for the album um, the song choices and uh, what we're going to pick, we're going to we're going to do about 18 songs. Cause the company's got a few songs that they might be able to offer me. And then out of the 18 songs, we're going to be putting out, say, 10 or 12. And then make sure it's a real good album. So please um, keep liking and thank you all for your comments and uh, everything. And uh, keep your eye out for the new... The new videos and songs and album coming soon. Together, what have we got? Well, it's rock and roll. What we got, what we got is rock and roll.